So if you have heartburn, indigestion, GERD, you're going to be very happy you watched this video. I mean, we all know what acid reflux and heartburn really is. It's too much acid, right? Is there a difference between acid reflux, heartburn, and the overproduction of acid? There's a huge difference, okay? When you have heartburn or acid reflux or GERD, where do you actually feel it? Do you feel it in the stomach? Usually not, unless you have an ulcer. Normally you feel it just above the stomach in the esophagus or even in the larynx as it can come up the esophagus into your throat. And so what you're going to soon learn is that heartburn, GERD, acid reflux is actually the opposite problem. It's usually not an overproduction of acid. It's an underproduction of acid. And I'm going to prove it. So let's go through this. I mean, I would bet you anything, if you go to your doctor with heartburn or acid reflux, they're not going to test the pH of your stomach, okay? They're not gonna check your acids. They're not gonna look at that because it's obvious that you have too much acid. But here's the problem. When you don't have enough acid, the valve on the top of the stomach doesn't necessarily close tightly enough. And the acid can then regurgitate up into the esophagus, making you think that you have too much acid, when in fact, you have just acid in the wrong place. It's a well-known fact that people develop GERD as they get older. Uh, you don't normally have this problem when you're younger. Well, with an exception of myself, I'm in my 20s I had this because I had really bad digestive issues, but that was more of an ulcer, okay, which actually also had some acid reflux. But normally speaking, as you age, okay, over 40, 50 years old, a lot more people get acid reflux. 